health is under the competences of member states. But when we are talking about M health and some benefits and advantages for patients, I think that we need to act together. Firstly, we need uh, new infrastructure. 5G will be the best solution. We need interoperability among all member states. We need uh, the same kind of standardization in all countries. And we need openness for uh, exchanging not only views, but exchanging and transferring the data. What Professor Dudek has done is he has presented a tri-dimensional model of a human heart that we are able to show interventional cardiologists in a augmented reality uh, environment. So basically an uh, interventional cardiologist can put on the Microsoft HoloLens device and powered by our software is able to both see the patient and see the patient's heart as it beats in their chest in real time and is able to uh, conduct a trans aortal valve replacement procedure looking at the heart, not seeing it open in the chest, but on the augmented reality tool. This was the first time when Doc, Professor Dr. Dudek showed this uh, technology and this MEDAP technology pre, uh, allows to any doctor in other countries also so, showed uh, this uh, heart and uh, interact with this heart. And this is something brand new and we, this is our first time when we show this technology. We need the ability to transfer data, to gather data, and to give data to providers. And through that, we need bandwidth, we need technologies to do that. We will gather the data, we will provide it. We're looking for the European Commission, European Parliament to help us mandate it as part of the development of the future in Europe and in the world. Coming from the specialist printing industry and seeing how incredible developments are enabled by printing, by screen printing already for some time now and recently more and more by digital inkjet printing, we see that technology as always is ahead of uh, legislation of politics. We have been very active uh, at the App Association in the elaboration of uh, the Code of Conduct on uh, e-health, on m-health, uh, and uh, this is a, a very uh, efficient tool to restore confidence between uh, the consumer and uh, the business community. This code still needs to be adopted uh, by the uh, working uh, party 29, which is the European regulator, but once it will be, Every uh, actor that will endorse uh, this kind of, uh, of code uh, will, be, uh, will distinguish from its competitors.